And look at these flowers. OMG, I just, how it looks. This is my lazy day food. Quarter to 12. I just finished getting ready. Always dancing, aren't you? <laughs> my foundation drawer, I also decluttered. I got rid of most of them. I used to have two drawers, now I only have one. Right, so for a while, my mom has been saying that she's running out of room space for her clothes. So I thought I would use up my big ass room, which is so big, um, use it up and get her a cupboard here. So got that in, oh my god, I'm just run out of breath. I ran upstairs um, after drinking half a liter of water. But um, got this cupboard from Ikea. It's gonna go here and then here. So she has plenty of room. I bought that for her um, and I think she's really excited. She's at work. But yeah, I'm gonna make that for her right now. So this wardrobe is so hard to, was so hard to make. I do um, And it's like coming off. Um, I need to like kind of pin it against the wall. Otherwise it's all coming off. It's just so not great. And because my carpet is so thick, my carpet is really thick. Um, it's legs would not keep it up. And um, when I didn't put those shelves in there, those are like two shelves by the way, that I've used to kind of raise the wardrobe up. Um, this door would not open. And I tried to maybe make the door a bit up, you know. Um, this is a cheaper alternative to the packs, and I think maybe that's why, or maybe because I have a carpet and everything is just, you know, not that great. Um, so I'm kind of struggling. I wish it kind of had leg supports. If it did have those, um, these have leg supports, and they these are not um, stuck to the back. They're just standing like this, and it works. Um, but then also maybe because these have doors, they're kind of struggling. But I'm just going to leave it like this. I'm sure my dad will think of some kind of thing that we can do. But this is what it's looking like. Um, this will be my backdrop for my holes. Probably going to have to be like this. Um, but yeah. Right, I'm about to go downstairs and make some dinner because huh, what's the time? I always have dinner around like quarter past eight when my mum gets back from work. It's been like a routine for the past ten years. I'm going to cook dinner and we're going to all eat together. So let's go down and make some food. So this wardrobe is called a Plasta and I don't recommend this from Ikea, it's not that great. Um, we put in, it's customizable so you can put whatever you want, you can put drawers and everything. Um, but yeah, don't recommend these, these are very flimsy as well, um, not that strong. Again, the bag, it didn't come with one of those. That's meant to be on the bottom and that's not meant to be there. It didn't come with those. Um, missed that one of them and then had to put in one of those looks so ugly now um but whatever you know this is it and loads of space kind of got some kind of thing going on up there um but yeah this is i like i love the fact that it's all white kind of thing and this is what the this corner looks like um that corner is always messy i know but all my shoes are here i don't know if i've ever showed this my shoes are here well yeah that's all my shoes and my bags um the light here is really yellow so i don't really show this corner too much um and then we have well let's give you a span of my room i tidied up all my drawers actually the other day all tidy these clothes are ready to be filmed and you know shown to you guys where they're from but yeah i did tidy up my drawers i switched things around so this is my brow drawer love this drawer so much but i do have my eyeliners in here mascaras but mainly brows i love this anastasia corner um what else did i do so i have my skincare in this one headbands and stuff um lip balms in that one and then just sheet masks that is all my sheet masks i have a lot this is the eye corner and then this is all the face masks. i actually need one today actually i might pull one out that i might like i don't know i'll do one later um I got tons of free space so I tidied away all my lighting um, which makes the space up here so much neater. I have all my bags here, um, more stuff like stuff in there. Then I have my blush 
and I moved my highlighters in here some of them liquid ones and then I put my powder ones in this one I tried to get rid of all my highlighters because I don't use them that much so I only kept my staple highlighters of course I have my Fenty um, and then all my powders I also decluttered that as well my foundation drawer I also decluttered I got rid of most of them I used to have two drawers now I only have one which I'm very happy about I love all of these foundations there's nothing in here that I don't like so it's a very good drawer and um, what else also got this oh my chair my primer drawer and also put some setting sprays in here because they didn't fit over there those are my big ones and these are my small ones I really love this drawer love my first Sally. I had a little foundation spillage there but yeah that's that what's in here oh yeah concealer I got rid of some of my concealers and then my bronzer I will never get rid of them because I love my bronzers so not, uh, not today what else did I do oh I put my printer in here it says load more paper but every time I need to use it I just kind of like plug it in from here it just ties it tidies it away it doesn't look you know cluttered kind of thing then I tidy up my lashes I don't have a lot of lashes um chucked most of the packaging up that was just there and I tidied away this I kind of wanted to get rid of my sling eyeshadows I never use them but I just thought oh I might you know it might be good for traveling those are all my extra products that's in there um some sweets as well snacks from what i'm up here but it's all extra stuff i've kept backups of those in there and then yeah this is just how it looks i'm not really happy with the setup obviously everything's so jumbled up but i just thought i'll give you a little tour of everything my skin's lacking on the first and i've never used this before um this is the herbie tea thirst trap cocoon mask um i got it two months ago I hadn't used it yet so I thought I'd give it a go today because my skin has been feeling really dry recently um, because it's kind of like clearing out I've been using a lot of salicylic acid glycolic acid you know all that stuff that really like a lot of acids and it has been drying out my skin and um, it hasn't been giving me any more spots which is absolutely amazing because that's what my problem was every time my skin because my skin is very dry every time I broke out I would put more acids and then it would dry me out but then the acid are helping it but then I would get even more breakouts so that was happening but um this time this is fine oh my god I look crazy um but yeah hopefully this mask is really good I washed my face with this uh CeraVe uh CeraVe what is it salicylic acid cleanser which I've been using a lot recently but I think you pull out this layer right oh it's so like it's a bit slimy um, leave it on for 20 minutes. My neck's been feeling really dehydrated as well recently. I've been drinking plenty of water. I drink about 3 litres every day. Um, sometimes more, sometimes a bit less. The least amount I would drink in a day is like 2.5 litres. Which is super good because um, 3 litres is like your limit. Well, that should be for my age and my height and my weight kind of thing. Um, but yeah, this is the mask. I'm going to leave it on for 20 minutes. I'll probably forget to vlog after this, but I'll see you guys tomorrow or something, just in case. Hey guys, so today is a brand new day. Um, I woke up with a super swollen face today, so I didn't want to show it straight away. also woke up with this mark, and it's just... It's so dry, there's a dry patch here. So I was going to film, but I'm not going to film anymore, because I'm not going to film with that on my face. And my sister's coming upstairs. Yes? What do you want? this is the outfit but <laughs> this is the outfit for today is saturday and this is the outfit and that's my sister's outfit she's wearing her nighty what she wore to bed no this is my daily outfit what did you wear to bed uh, short short on a different t-shirt oh this, this is your house outfit yeah yeah this t-shirt this is yeah. i know i bought it for you that's why <laughs> but you never bought these this is the best trousers I own. <laughs> so this um, hoodie, hoodie, this jumper is from H&M. I got it ages ago. It was in my H&M Basics haul. I don't know if you guys have watched that, but I will link it like here, wherever it's going to come. Um, these trousers are from Pretty Little Thing. They're super comfy. The only thing is they don't have pockets. They have pockets here, so it's okay. Just when I'm around the house, I like to have pockets so that I can put my phone in. But yeah, this is the outfit for today. Always dancing, aren't you? <laughs> oh my god, is my camera hot? Yes, is it about to die on me? Yes, but I just thought I'd show you guys. I love this mask. This is from um, 
This is from Fresh. I thought I'd give my skin a little bit of a radiance boost. So I'm using this Seaweed Radiance Mask. I love this stuff. I've gone through so much of this. I'm also using my Glow London. No, Skin Glow London Glow Eye Mask. I love this. I've used like four or five of this. And I love the face one as well. I've never seen a difference like that before. And I really saw it with this mask. So I will link it down below. I absolutely love it. So I thought I would kind of mention it in this vlog. Um, but I'm about to go chill. Let my camera rest a little bit. Apply this mask for like 10 minutes I think. I think and then I'm gonna wash it off but yeah just thought I would mention a little mask self-care moment hey guys um excuse the mess in the background but I just got changed I'm about to head out for the walk um it's about an hour and a half drive almost two hours and I'm wearing my friend's shirt that I got from H&M got my jewelry on because I wanted to be cute I haven't put those on in a while and then I got my jeans Yes, style. I love these. I told you guys ages ago. And then I got my shoes from Nasty Girl that I bought um, that I absolutely love. Got my Apple Watch on to get me going. And yeah, these sunnies are from um, Amazon. I put on the lightest amount of makeup because I'm still flaring out over here. Um, but very dewy. I got the Fenty Hydration Foundation because that's my favorite foundation. Fits me so well. Um, but yeah, that's it. And some brows, some lip liner, lip gloss. Um, Bronzer and blush, that's my everyday kind of go-to kind of thing. No eyelashes because I can't bother. Melissa, and I hit accidentally hit her. Well. You accidentally hit her. No, we both had, we were gonna hit, we were gonna throw a rock and then we hit each other. Hey guys, today is the next day. Um, yesterday was so sad. Came home, had dinner really quick. No one else had dinner, only I did. I had um, chicken and rice, amazing, with coconut. Oh, so delicious. And yeah, I just went to bed straight away. Well, I didn't go to bed. I sat in bed for until midnight and then I fell asleep. It's really hard for me to fall asleep. I don't know what's wrong with me, but I can't fall asleep until I've exhausted myself. So I watched loads of like YouTube videos. Um, I finished Friends for the second time. <laughs> um, then um, what happened this morning? I woke up super late. I don't have my watch on, but I woke up at around I woke up around eight. Turn off my alarm. Obviously, my alarm's always set for eight, and then turn it off. Um, woke up at half nine to my sister. And then I watched my phone for like an hour. Then I woke up at half ten. It's currently quarter to 12 I just finished getting ready I washed my hair yesterday obviously after coming back from that long walk um didn't want to curl it don't have time I have to film a video because I haven't ate breakfast I always do this I don't eat my breakfast and then I film because I don't feel so bloated then I will film a try and hard then I'll have my breakfast lunch whatever brunch um I only do it like twice a week I don't do this all the time I have my breakfast every day <clears throat> I try to um I just did my makeup very quick I'm really happy with my makeup today it's like my everyday go-to glam it Apart from that, uh, apart from the fact that my chin is a bit dry, um, hopefully you won't be able to see that in the video. But I really need to get this video filmed because I have no YouTube content at the moment. 
um so i really need to get my summer try on haul kind of sorted out um i bought loads of clothes that i'm really into at the moment um i wear them all the time i think you guys might have seen it but i just want to throw on like a little summer haul because i haven't done one of those yet I keep doing like hauls from like a shop you know like top shop I'll, I'll do like a whole H&M haul but I haven't done bits from everywhere and it's like a nice summer casual kind of whole clothes that I wear all the time I'm very comfortable with and obviously no one's well people are going out right now but I'm not don't do that anyway I'm not really like a going out person um, I just don't enjoy that I'll go out for a drink but I'm not really club kind of person and I really want to get that film to this so I will be doing that right now just did my makeup very quick. I'm very happy with it. I love how the lips look. I've never used this lipstick before. I love this combination. I used NYX Cold Brew. That's one of my favorite lip liners for my skin tone. So if you have like my skin tone, it I think that would be amazing lip liner if you guys are looking for one that's affordable. It's only like $4.99. I have like five of them. No kidding. I have five of them. Um, but yeah, I'm about to go film this video. And what else am I doing today? I'm doing literally nothing got to film this i got to work on my secret project i can't wink for shit but i'm working on something very secret at the moment that i'm very excited to work on and show you guys um but yeah i will be working on that today because i have nothing in terms of like work and deadlines because everything's kind of like slow at the moment because of miss corona but yeah i want to get one video <laughs> one youtube video filmed today and then one video edited um, it should have gone up by this time, so I will link it like here or there, I don't know. Um, but yeah, that is in the agenda for today, and yeah, watch me film a try-on haul. I just finished filming my video it probably is live already I'm not really sure if it's not then it will be my next video um, I just put my hair up because I can't bother um, just put some side parts about to go downstairs and make some lunch because all I've had today is iced coffee in a beer glass so love that for me I need to get a bottle for my iced coffees because I've been loving iced coffees recently I just don't want to drink hot coffee in the morning it gets too hot um, but yeah I'm gonna go downstairs and make some lunch I'll show you guys what I'm eating. how it looks this is my lazy day food so i take my kimchi um i put some i look put uh i take my kimchi and i put loads of water in it i let it simmer until the water is all gone and then um it's got no like broth kind of thing because that makes it even more spicier um and then i just um fry an egg and then eat and this is really quick and easy um i've got loads of work to do and i'm gonna show you guys some unboxing after i eat this so yeah let me eat this up and i'll be right back Right, so I've got a couple parcels that I thought I'd show you guys. I got this really cute parcel in this morning. Look at these flowers. OMG, I am so, like, happy. I've been wanting something like this for a while. Um, so Elmas sent this over. They said, say hello to Fresh Faced Glow. So they have a new um, cleanser out. This has AHA in it. Um, and then they also have a moisturizing prime glow priming my moisturizer oh my god um it has kombucha in it that's quite interesting isn't it um brightens and nourishes and hydrates so i'm excited to use that and then this one um cleanses brightens and nourishes as well so i'm excited to um use these then yeah so this and all of the product this is what the packaging looks like it's brand new I'm very excited i love the color it's very summery and they also sent over this really cute bag so cute look at them um love that so thank you so much to elmas for sending that over this morning 
Then we have, um, I thought I'd show you guys another package that I just got. Oh, dropped it. Oh, purple mask. I've been wanting a mask actually for a while because of my hair. How oh, am I so excited to use that? So L'Oreal sent this over. Oh my god, I've been, I literally asked the other day on my stories, like, what should I use? And I guess I can use this. Um, so they sent over a shampoo and a conditioner. Cute. And the mask. Very excited. Thank you. I can't wait to get rid of my breasts in this. Hopefully it works. I'll keep you guys updated. Oh, um, so I also got these. Um, so Shishado sent over this new um, Mochi. Mochi? Mochi mask, I guess. Mochi, that's what it's called. They also sent over some sweets. Very cute. Right, um, I just came upstairs. I took off my makeup because it was getting a bit too much. I kind of exfoliated my skin around here because there was just a lot of... Um, dead skin cells i didn't do it harshly i used my um cleanser this is a balm cleanser from charlotte tilbury that i absolutely love i use it very sparingly because it's very expensive but i just took a little cloth and then i used that cleanser kind of like scrubbed it. it was very gentle nothing too extreme so it kind of got rid of all the dry tightness that was going around i think that was like my layer of skin that's like dead and it's like gone which is absolutely amazing so i just did that i'm gonna do my like everyday um skincare kind of thing and yeah i'll be right back hey guys so um i think i'm gonna end this vlog here honestly if i wanted i could probably film all day all the time but i think we shall end this one here because i did a lot and i don't even know if i'll be able to compress it into like 20 25 minutes video um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog. Um, it might have been all over the place, I'm sorry, but I tried to do it as best as I could. I've been trying to get better at filming vlogs. Sometimes I seem to do things and I don't explain what I do. Hopefully this video was quick and easy to follow and you got um, an insight on what, happened, what I do like everyday kind of thing, situation. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Mwah.